Good morning, Tony. So far, things look pretty much normal here at SAC International Airport. Travelers do tell me they're a little bit on edge, though, as they prepare to get on a flight this morning. We have seen a patrol car with the Sheriff's Department parked in front of Terminal A all morning long. Earlier, there were two vehicles here, but that is standard procedure for the most part as far as airport security is concerned. And we are seeing more travelers than usual this week because it is spring break for many families. And most travelers we spoke with this morning say they're very sad about the incidents that happened, but had no plans to change their vacation. Several families even said attacks happen so often that you start to become immune to hearing about it. Some people mentioned that for the most part, they have always felt safe in the walls of an airport, but this incident definitely has them a little bit more alert this morning and the attacks do have them feeling a bit vulnerable. I think your number's up when your number's up. I just hope that that there are no more accidents like this. It's pretty awful. I mean, you really can't do anything. I mean, other than stereotyping people, I mean, what really can you do? I mean, you know, I'm sure that whatever happened, these people look normal and everything, so I'm not really sure what can be done. It's not terribly surprising. I think it's sort of a sign of things to come, most likely, but uh, it's the world we live in today. And this morning we put several calls into airport officials, but we are still waiting at this hour to hear what plans, if any, they have to beef up security here at the airport. We will let you know as soon as we find out. Reporting live here at SAC International Airport, I'm Leticia Ordaz, KCRA 3 News.